for Christmas Eve. So you notice we've done this slightly different today because we, I wanted to come on so I could do a little bit of a Christmas message as well as open the final door to the Nail Team Advent Calendar. Now apologies, I've not done the backdrop today. It's literally come on to do a quick video and then we're gonna go and have our family Christmas Eve day and what have you and I just couldn't be bothered, but there we go. So, before we open up that final door, what have I got to do? Show off yesterday's swatch. Show off yesterday's swatch. Now I'm not sure how well I'll be able to show it because obviously I've got different camera angle and everything. But what I'm gonna do at the end of this video is pop some pictures. So I'll pop a picture of yesterday's and a picture of today's. Uh, the last four and then I might try and get some pictures of all of them so there'll be loads of pictures at the end of the video but this was yesterday's glitter That's a bit. there we go so this was a really nice hollow black and silver mix now when I opened it I said it's got stars and I could see a moon when I swatched it it had dots and hearts as well so it's a really really nice mix now I wonder if Ryan can has the same idea as I had as when this glitter would be good for let me see it let me just let him see it Halloween -y? Halloween he's 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 all right yeah, there isn't he so that was yesterday's glitter the 23rd glitter but now um, of glitter. Time to find out what the last glitter is for the 2020 Nail Team Advent Calendar. Now I'm not going to open it so I can hold it up because that's just going to go horribly wrong. But Ryan, do you want to do the honours? I'll put it there for better speed. Yeah, sorry, you can't see, he can see. Drum roll. Drum roll. <gasps> is it gold? Yeah. Oh, I wanted silver. Okay. Oh, this is pretty. I think it... I'm not sure if it's a fine glitter or not. But this is what the last glitter is. Lots of hollow. It's gold. It is gold. And it's there fitting for the occasion. Very fitting for the occasion. Very pretty glitter. I'm not sure if it's fine or if it's got any chunky. Let me just open it and have a look. Do you need your mixing stick? I won't use the mis mix miskin. It's a fine. It's a nice. It's more of a bronzy gold than a goldy gold, isn't it? Yeah. It's like... So it's another fine glitter. Um, so I will. I will swatch it. I will put pictures at the end of the video but that is it that is the final glitter of the 2020 nail team advent calendar what do you think what have you thought of all the glitters they all look really really nice really really nice yeah i'm really pleased with all of them there's a great collection of 24 glitters um god will go well in the collection it will go well in the collection there's uh, lots of different colours, there's glitters that you can use at different seasons, not just for Christmas, so it's a really nice calendar. Gemma and Matthew, if you helped, I, I'm sure we'll thank Matthew as well, but Gemma, thank you so much for such an amazing advent calendar. And Ryan, thank you for helping me open it every day in our videos. My pleasure. So that's it. That is the end of the 24-day uh, advent calendar from the nail team. And that is also the end of me for Christmas. Um, but what I wanted to do before I logged off of this video, and that's the other reason I've done it like this, I wanted to take an opportunity to say a huge thank you to a few people. Um, Firstly, I'd like to say a huge, huge, huge thank you to all of you, my viewers and my subscribers, uh, those of you that have liked my videos throughout the year, that have commented on my video, thank you so much. Uh, it means the world to me, it means a lot to him as well, uh, and I can't wait to bring you bigger and better things in the new year. Um, I'm obviously going to thank this little guy because he is... Um, 
my number one supporter. Like your mascot. He is my mascot. He's also the person that keeps pushing me to do it. Um, so he's the one that gives me motivation when I'm feeling pretty lousy. So thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> um, I'm not doing an acceptance speech for the Oscars or anything like that. I just wanted to um, do this. I thought Christmas was a great time to do it. Uh, a massive thank you also has to go to all the girls from the nail team, so all the fellow ambassadors uh, and the educators joining the nail... Sorry, am I keeping you awake? You've got glitter on your face now. Uh, joining the nail team this year has been an absolute honour. Um, I have loved every minute of it. I have had so much motivation, so much passion again. Normally uh, around November time I it dips off and then Christmas I don't tend to do a lot of nail related stuff uh, or that's been the case the last few years. This year I have just, I've been in the zone, um, I've so much motivation even looking ahead into 2021. I've This morning I've started up some of my YouTube graphics for next year to just update and change them up a bit. So that is in huge part because I've got this great team of girls behind me, uh, encouraging me, supporting me. So thank you to all of you girls. And last but by no means least, a massive, massive, massive thank you to Gemma. Because Gemma has really picked me up this year when I needed it. And I know Gemma, if you're watching, I know you've had a horrible year with various things. And I know you think you have not done enough and supported people enough but I can only talk for myself but I'm sure plenty of people agree Gemma you have been amazing you have given me this opportunity you have given me support encouragement and most importantly you've given me friendship so thank you so much Gemma and I I really cannot wait to see what 2021 brings you brings us brings the nail team and I look forward to working with you even more then so thank you Gemma for everything um but that's it that's my little oscars acceptance speech done <laughs> um so i think that is it i might sneak one or two videos in between now and the new year well i will definitely sneak one in because i've done a new year's eve design oh, nice. yeah um but this is it from me until after christmas now so it's going to be a strange one this year, very, very strange. Um, we're, we're quite fortunate because we only tend to spend Christmas with us and with my grandma, so his great grandma, and she's in our support bubble anyway, so we've not had to make any massive changes. Um, but it's still going to be strange. But all I can say to you all is make the most of it. and make memories that you are going to take into years to come and think back and go oh 2020 what a what a rubbish. awful rubbish year that was but Christmas we still made it special and we made it good and so to all of you happy Christmas however you are spending the day the days whatever you are doing relax enjoy and make those memories and um you know I hope you're all on the the good list I nearly said naughty I hope you're all on the good list and Santa brings you everything your heart could possibly desire um don't nail eat wise. nail wise yeah don't eat too much because we will <laughs> don't drink too much we you won't can't. I can't no I might have one little glass of wine that'll be about it um but have a wonderful time have a wonderful Christmas um thank you again for everything your support this year is one of the best christmas presents i could possibly get we are going to have even more to come in 2021 but i will come on again in the new year to talk about that so i think from me and from him that is it so merry christmas and have a fabulous few days merry christmas you're not even in try again Merry Christmas. Yeah, Merry Christmas, guys. Thank you so much. Love you all. And we'll see you again very soon. Mwah. Bye.